Hi everyone, welcome back. We're playing Overcrowd today. The map seed is Honeywell. The difficulty level is set too hard. Uh, so far it's been pretty easy, but we will see what zone two has in store for us. Barrister Green, um, where it looks like the commuters are pigs and we will be executing mice. Uh, sounds fun, let's go. Did I not click on it? I did. Start. Start the game, Honeywell. And here we are. We're going to hit the space bar. Pause this. What an absolutely ugly map. There is no about, doubt about it. Honeywell is a bad seed. <laughs> what do we have going on here? Okay, here are our lines. We're at 2 at minus 3, 2 at minus 2, 1 at minus 1. And what about our stations? We have a minus 2, a minus 1. So two at level two, one at one. And what do we have over here? A ground and one. So we have two minus ones, two minus twos, and two minus two. I think what makes sense is to start out on floor minus two. The only reason why is because if we can avoid having to put build staircases, uh, that saves us money. We do not have a lot to start with. And do you know what? We did not get any cheaty free tiles. What, we have three over here? Oh, but that's at minus two. So that's something, right? Do we want to start over here? I don't know. Now I just paused the recording for a minute just so I could get a look at what is this camera. Um, it looks like our grounds, our two tracks on ground two are these ones over here. So this is the train track that we're going to want to use. So let's turn off the tracks just so this is less annoying. Now we have a couple free, ti free tiles over here. I mean, that's only 75, uh, monies but i guess we probably want to use them now we'll have this station over here where we could get how many people are in this one there's less people in this one we might want this one do we want to start out with more people you know i think we're going to start out down here because we have these three free tiles and when we go to hook up these stations we can put a nice long wall of advertising for these people to uh pay the bills yeah so i like that or do we really want those more people well you know what less people is easier and maybe that's why we've been having such an easy time of it because uh the traffic flow at these stations have been low yeah, let's do that. Okay, so we know we're going to start at this entrance. Same level. Um, what other information do we have? Now we have the commuters, when they enter the building, they are going to be full of trash, very angry, pockets are kind of full, and they are diseased. What a bunch of diseased pigs. <laughs> but do you see this money level? I am wondering if... If the reason why I had so much success uh, banging our our prices uh, way down earlier, maybe the earlier stations our commuters didn't have money. Maybe I misunderstood uh, the mechanic. So I think we're going to try not reducing our um, the prices on our vended goods and see how we make out with that. And maybe we'll jack up our, our ticket sales right at the beginning because I'm a little bit concerned about money. Okay, so there is that disease pigs angry so we definitely we need we need all of our staff to deal with this uh how are we going to do this what else do we need to know we need to know how big we need our train track right so we're at four carriages five carriages will be unlocked so 
let's uh let's bang down some floor tiles and see how long we need to make our our train track I can see max three carriages so in order to get five two more for four so we need seven more tiles what is that eight why is that I hate this counting mechanic I wish it was like the sims okay so that should be eight tiles let's try our uh Add four more cells. Oh, I think we went one too far. Let's take that off. And now let's see. And let's set the... Um, yeah, I don't want them to enter down this way. Or do we just want to do... Oh, maybe I could mate them in the middle this way. So maybe we do want them to come down here because then we could do two. A wall of advertising to uh, cash in on these people because I really think money is gonna be an issue. What are our goals? I'm betting it's four platforms. Yeah, four platforms, build a level one rat prod. Oh, that's sweet, we're gonna get an extra 500 pounds so we want to build that hopefully we'll get these uh, cash bonuses for station rep okay so we're definitely going to put in a tool room and we're going to buy a rat prod right off the bat because we'll get uh, 500 more pounds for that and then uh, do we get one do we get a thousand for opening no Oh no, open the, to the public. Okay, so there's 1,500 more pounds that we have to work with. Okay, that is good to know. So here we have our station. Um, but can we change the camera angle? Yeah, okay. So we're gonna build this way and that actually works out because then that is gonna put us closer to adding in these commuters, which will bring in more money. So is this right dead in the middle? Let's add some more floor tiles here. Yeah, I don't know that we're gonna play at all today. Because, uh, yeah. Well, instead of, let's just... Maybe, maybe we wanna do it this way, like two here two here and then take out the middle tiles because money really is a concern oh but they need <laughs> they, they need some <laughs> okay let's not get carried away let's put back in those tiles they have to have some room on the platform here i don't know we're already at six six thousand hmm I think I am going to uh, pause the game and build and I'll bring you back. Okay, here we are. Uh, quick note, I'm recording this episode over multiple days and patches, so some things have changed. But after much wrangling and penny pinching, I think we have our budget starter station all ready to go here. Uh, we splashed out on some nice plants uh, so we can get some easy reputation points right off the bat. Um, included lights, of course. If you open a dark, gloomy station, you will be heavily penalized. Uh, so lights are a must. We included a newspaper stand and a crisp machine. So there was some sort of shopping at the station. Um, I suspect that our commuters are not gonna be happy with the range of goods offered here because they were already starting to complain at the last station. Uh, so I expect that to continue here and we'll want to uh, put in a coffee a coffee cart as soon as possible. Um, but as you can see, there is absolutely no room because every penny counted. Uh, I did well to afford even this little bit of uh, space here. 
Um, we don't have a staff room yet, uh, so much we need, um, but I think we're in a good position to expand here. I went heavy on the advertisements in the hopes that we'll generate some much needed income. And I also jacked the prices up on the ticket machine from 10 pounds to 15 pounds. Um, so we'll wanna make sure that people aren't too unhappy about that. Uh, some complaints are fine, but we, won't, but we don't wanna get uh, dinged too heavily right off the bat on prices. So if it looks like um, most are complaining, we'll have to lower those to avoid that. And what else? Um, our tool room is slightly larger. We have a lot of tools now, um, so I don't want to get uh, stuck in an emergency um, and not have money to expand the tool room and need to buy a tool. So right off the bat, I went ahead and made that a little larger. Um, we have a little larger uh, utility room, but we still need a staff room. Uh, yeah, but enough blather. Let's. Let's kick this off and see how it works out. Uh, you'll notice, yay! So we got a thousand pounds for opening this to the public. Oh, look at them advertisements, that's good. That is excellent. Bring in the money. And we also, if we get a little uh, rat tool, we'll also get money for that. Nice plant. They, uh, they want some things. So we're at 51%. 52, our mood is going up, so that is good. Now we got rush hour here. Let's start, we're going to, we're not gonna bang in all of our staff at once, um, but we are going to start bringing them in. I think we're gonna start off with Millie. Um, yes, we're gonna start off with Millie. So let's get her in with her megaphone and a med kit. Well, do we want to go ahead? No, let's do, let's just give her all her tools and then that way we won't have to worry about it. So she's going to have the medical kit, then the information, and then information, we'll call the train, and then the megaphone. And let's get her out here to see if she can't get these people on their way. You see they have little icons for like eclairs and stuff. Are we on fast? Let's slow that. Oh no, that's fast. Let's slow that down. Everybody get where you're supposed to go. Is she not? Let's move her up here. Maybe she can uh, get these people going. Oh, she's hungry. We need a staff room. You bought your tickets, get on the board. That's right. Get a move on. We need a staff room. Okay. And there is trash already. Okay, so we need a staff room and we need our next employee. Um, who is our refuse? I think Cleo is 61%. And Daniel is repairs. So let's get, let's get Cleo in. And Cleo is our custodian. So let's get her, we're gonna get a bonus for this rat catching station. So let's get her that. Nice, another 500 pounds. And then we will want to get her a litter picker and the watering can. Uh, you know what, the watering can can wait. The watering can can wait. So let's get her, first we want the rat catching thing on her. And then we want her to get the litter picker. And now we need to build a, a staff room. And I think I'm just gonna put in a tiny one right off the corridor over here. Right here. Is this okay? Now let's, let's go right there because we're gonna, we're gonna need to expand this eventually. Yeah, right there. 
staff room. Great, and what do we have? She is hungry and thirsty. So yeah, let's, do we have enough? We want to keep every we want to keep everybody alive and happy. I did not know your staff can die, but they can. 250 200 450 600 Let's do it. So this is out of the way. Food, drinks. Yeah, let's you know, you got to take care of your people. Okay, so there we go. <laughs> We need to we need to generate some income here okay and I'm assuming everyone is still on auto breaks so they should uh, take care of it and we're gonna have to wait to see if that was like a one-off you can't afford a bag of crisp get out of here can't afford hold on let's take a look at our reports we're at 56 uh, percent so we're going up and there was litter because these people are disgusting pigs High prices aren't too high. We're going to have to keep an eye on that. Bad shopping range. We knew that. High prices. Uh, but look at that. 46% on the aesthetic there. We're going we're gonna to keep this going for right now and see uh, and see how we go. Yeah, you want a hot dog? Everybody wants a hot dog, guy. You're not getting one. 56%. I'm taking it real slow here because uh, in the beginning, uh, you don't want anything to fall apart right quick. Are we ready for another employee? I think we are. Now, who else do we have? Uh, Daniel is our repair person, so we want Daniel on. And then I think we want security on as well, right? George, George Brown, he does not wear a cowboy hat, more of the pity. Yeah, let's get Daniel in because we want to make sure everything is in good repair. So Daniel, you're up. Um, our generators are full and we only have 500 pounds. Let's get him, let's just get him the, the toolkit for right now. crowded and let's splash out on another megaphone that will help them scale what people 22 okay we're gonna get him the toolkit and a megaphone and tools are first a vandal has And we're just, we're gonna call in our security guy and hope that we uh, get money for this stuff. That who is security? Don't we have a good? Oh, that's applicants. I was gonna say our people are better than this. Okay, security fifty one percent and Isaac White White is our security guy. Okay, so let's get let's get White a crime desk. I know, not enough money. <laughs> and let's hope we can uh, generate some income before we have to pay these people or less uh, we'll be in trouble. Okay, so we're gonna pick him, have him do that. Taking it nice and easy. Let's call the train. Mally, pick up this megaphone. White, get out here and look officious. Mally, come up here with the turnstiles and that megaphone. Uh-oh. What was that? Did something... Oh, here... Stupid vandal. They're destroying our turnstile. Wait, you better be on that. Good job. Get out of here. Going to jail, that's right. Oh, rodent problem. Oh, but we're already on, uh, get out here. Take care of business, Jackson.
Okay, I think we're doing okay. We're up to 381, so that advertising and ticket sales must be okay. Looking good, we're up to three bonds. And I noticed we carried our bond over from the last station. I don't know if I, uh, if that was changed sometime when I played or if I just didn't realize that that happened. But the bonds do carry over, so we don't have to go on a spending spree. That looking good, um, let's, what about our repairs? The vandal had a go at this one over here. Let's start doing some preventive maintenance. Our trash bins look okay. We're going to need a watering can though, aren't we? Let's buy one while we have some money. A watering can. And we also need to be able to refill the generator, so let's get a jerry can. And uh, we still need a fuel barrel too, so. Do we have enough to give White some uh, more work? White, what are you, you're, you're decent at refuse. And medical. And people, because I give everybody megaphones. You know what, let's, let's go f for broke here and we're gonna give White a megaphone. Can't afford. Why is everybody so broke? I thought they were all supposed to be flush with cash. Let's take a look at our reports. We're up to 67%. High prices, mm, I'm still gonna keep it because we want money. And that we got dinged early on for that piece of litter that some pig threw on the ground. Wait, he's drinking on the job. Nice plant, that's right. Those plants were a good decision. And you're, let's get a chair. Uh, 400, 400 pounds. We need money for the end of the night too. So we can't go crazy, but we are generating some income. Mally, go pick up the, no. Oh, hold on. You're gonna have to start repairing stuff, Mally. White, go pick up a megaphone start skilling you up. You want crisps? There's a machine right there. Oh, look at that. Oh, reputation over 75%, 900 pounds. That is good. Can we afford a little bit more tiles and maybe a crisp machine over here? Can we uh, get crazy like that? No, you know what we should get? We should get a couple benches. Only two, but still. We don't want to get, we don't want these people to be too upset. And let's put, let's put a bench right there. Back to back benches, 75%. Let's keep that rep going up. Pricey. You pricey people are gonna have to get over it. We want money. And you want a newspaper. We need to get um, vending machines over here. Let us give us a little bit more concourse and let's do a, a crisp machine, crisps, and a newspaper stand. There we go. And we're leaving the default prices on these in the hopes that we're gonna get some money and it'll be worth it. Look, they're leaving the station. They get flooded with those advertisements. Are they buying these newspapers? 30? We sold 30 newspapers. What about the crisps? And not as many crisps. Maybe this isn't in a good spot. Rush hour. <gasps> Our train is broken and you weren't, and, uh, and I'm sitting here faffing about with crisp machines and newspaper stands. Where's Jackson? Jackson, get up. Take care of that trash. Okay, I think it is, we have nine. White, 
Have you been standing there that whole time, guy? Get out here. There's white. Didn't we upgrade our stock? Did we upgrade that? Oh, if we've been using these old trains this whole time when we didn't need to. We have, th oh, we can open up three platforms. Yeah, we should have new trains. Oh man, we missed a trick here. Okay, let's see if we can't get our new stock number two. Yes, please. Okay, and that means that 47%, oh, we're still at 100% on the ticket machine though. And 86%, quit with that and go repair the turnstile. And King leveled up, awesome. Uh, yeah, let's get her, and we have Jackson to take care of the mice. Let's give her another strength slot. Uh, one more and she can carry four items, so that'll be nice for us. It's going on the end of the night. Are we still good? We're only at 88% though, that's like not stellar. How is... And we have gas on the platform because of that broken down train. Darn it. Repair that, 39%. What did you do, break it? And Jackson, come take care of this trash because it is time. And then you also want to go pick up, oh, get up here and see if you can help those people. Okay, and then when she's done with that trash, we're gonna have her pick up the watering can because that should be time. Good, good. Nope, don't go there yet. Go pick up the watering can. And Mally, repair that. 35, are you breaking it? What good are you, guy? Okay, there we go. That's better. And we'll get a last train in before we close. And we're doing pretty well. We have oh, facilities, utilities. We need another trash bin. Let's see. One, two, a trash bin. Um, a fuel barrel. Three hundred. Let's go for broke. Let's get an air purifier. An air purifier. Mally is going to need to pick up a gas can. Oh, well, let's let them eat first. Everybody get on board. Reputation is 100%, another 2,000 pounds. That is excellent. So you know what that means. It means that pretty soon we can uh, tunnel our way over here and bring in some more people. Here we go, 3,200, nice. I think that is a, that was a really good first day, I think. We have some, uh, we splurged on some extras. Do you know what? Let's, let's just put in, give them a little bit more room over here. A little bit more room over here and yeah let's have let's start getting all the trash taken out we'll start well let's let's start watering and trash and white looks like he needs a security camera so let's do that too a security camera right there is that a good spot that one's probably better, huh? Okay, so we'll we'll put that uh that crazy security camera in. And here we go. Prices are high, but they're not that high because we're at a hundred percent. Because look at the aesthetic. Uh, having that plant right by the front door, so good. Uh, our journey, we're getting our trains out of here. It's a little gloomy. We could probably use some more lights, but uh yeah. 
Not bad. Not bad. I'm gonna go ahead and uh, take care of the overnight chores and, well, actually, do you know what I think it's, uh, I will take, do that on another episode. Now, I'm not sure how much uh, more of this I can record. Like I said, there were some changes. Um, let's pause this so I don't uh, mess anything up. The, the staff now cost money instead of bonds to purchase and there is going to be an update soon where it's going to require us to uh, restart our campaigns and I don't know that I'm going to uh, to do that so I'll go ahead and as long as I can I'll finish playing this station but we need four platforms uh, which is a lot well I mean they're going to be pretty easy though because we have four right here another one we can just hop across and that'll give us two we can go down a level and then we have our two more uh, but we'll also want to get some more foot traffic in here. So I don't know if I'm going to have time to uh, to finish playing this level before we complete it. Uh, but we will see. I will uh, I will do my best. Uh, but that is, yeah, I think I think that is all for now. I'm going to uh, take care of the overnight uh, activities with these guys, and. Uh, take out the trash, water the plants. We'll have Mally uh, repair everything. We'll also, now that we have some money, we'll look into bringing in the rest of our staff on board. Um, let's give them another chair now that we have one, have money for one. And we have seven bonds. What can we purchase? We still, we can't get five carriages until we unlock more. So I guess we can't purchase anything really. Nope. Uh, these we're, we don't need, I don't think. Tools? No, we're good. Commerce? I mean, we don't have room for any of this stuff. A cash machine would probably be nice. Um, but maybe that'll be for another time. We also have the medicine cabinet. Uh, but yeah, I think it is, uh, off, we're off to a really good start. I was kind of worried about how small this was, but, uh, I don't think it's bad at all. Thank you so much for watching. If you liked the video, please leave a like. And I will see you for the next one. Bye-bye.